Okay, what's going on everyone? It's Shin here. Uh, hi, how's it going? The last episode, we kind of left off with this thing up here. Um, as you'll notice, I went over here and I removed all my animals. I got these big, nice fields. The reason for that is because we need loads of potatoes and we know need like loads of wheat just because it's all fried and floured stuffs, french fries and stuff like that. I got my house in here. You would have thought I also move, um, I need a elephant name like i need a name for the elephant i went and got me a penguin from uh what's what's called drago's place i still got thanos the purple pig but i need a name for that i need a name for the elephant and i need a name for the uh penguin also if i sound super nasally it's because well that's how i sound but also i'm kind of sick so uh please please bear with me um yeah this is kind of what we got going on inside here my little enchantment setup got some smokers for the uh the the water bottles for salt got a bunch of inventory stuff got some uh you know just just the usual just uh just just uh just usual survival stuff you know what i'm saying the real magic is downstairs though as i mentioned in the last video because well yeah it's where the real magic happens uh i got this breeder oh my gosh Guys, slow down. What are y'all doing? Oh, no. That's so many. Oh, my gosh. Ah, skeleton. Ah. No. Oh, no. What? You know what? Nope. Nope. Nope, not at all. Anyways, yeah, look at all look at all that stuff. We have collected literally almost every single seed. Actually, every single seed. I got the achievement for it. Look at this. I, I got I got all of the, the, the seeds. I got them all. So they're all here. I got them all. They're all here. This is awesome. Yeah, we got we got every single crop to be seed, so that means we can start pumping out foods. We got the seeds. Got the, the, the vegetables and fruits. Got the seeds and fruits. Got a composter hop system thing here. Yeah, I mean, life is good. Life is good. I wanted to show a little bit of progress on like what we've what we've kind of been doing here because well we've got something to build today. We've got you know villagers. We got dude. I sound so nasally and it's very irritating to me. Oh my gosh. We got the. Uh, sorry if you guys find this disturbing, but I need leather, meat, and the. Uh, pigs and <laughs> yeah but we're chilling we are chilling okay we are chilling also one of the other last kind of couple of things that i wanted to actually show you guys was my my, my iron farm okay my, my little iron farm it was actually a waddles design so i found this up on on the youtubes and uh yeah it's pretty efficient it, except it's in the air i couldn't really make it into the ground because if i go into free cam here you've got like kind of a, a nasty cave down here so it, it's kind of disgusting but yeah it's pretty much uh it's it's a waddles design it, it's very very efficient so i have the iron farm going on over here path blocks to make sure the iron gone Columns don't uh, spawn over there. And then after that is my little sheep farm, my little sheepies. Look at all that. I got the whole entire Skittles pack of uh, sheeps. So when I need wool and I'm going to need a lot of it for like beds, duvet cover, sheets and all of that jazz, it, this is going to come into handy. So you might actually be thinking... Jen, what are you going to do with all these sheets and like sheeps and stuff like that? I mean, you can't possibly need it for a couple of hotels and you're actually you're actually right. I mean, like that, that is true. So why not monetize it? Build a furniture store. You know what I mean? Like just build. Let's build a furniture store and we could sell duvet covers because they're very expensive with needing all of the all of the wool and stuff like that. So, yeah, I mean, that's it, that's that's kind of the that's kind of the whole whole gist of it. Uh, of course, as I mentioned before, I have my little farm up here. Uh, and one other thing that I did in between, like, you know, pause, stop, record, pause, stop, record, pause, stop, record. Villager, holy cow, man. I, 
I, it was I wanted to do something. I'm going to save something for next next episode, which is that little thing right there. I'm going to save that. That's a pretty cool. Th Actually, you know what? Let me just go ahead and get the materials for it and I'll show you what that does. But I also have a little sugarcane farm that I got from iCraft MC, which is a very efficient design. I'm not a true Minecrafter, guys. OK, you know, I, I get my stuff from from tutorials and I don't know. I just want to have fun. You know what I mean? I don't want to spit like this. This right here, that took me two hours of time to figure out how to make this work, okay? Let me go get my stuff. Let me go get the stuff for it, and then I'll show you exactly what it does, okay? So, I got all of my stuff. Now, we have the mod Croptopia, and I'm going to open up my inventory, and you're going to see me type in here, juice, right? Juice. I'm. We're going to work with apple juice today, okay? Apple juice. So, I have an apple all-purpose food press and a glass bottle and that makes apple juice well this is in 1.21 where we eventually got the crafter in place using the crafter i can automatically make the apple juice but now this is what happens when you make apple juice you see the food processor is gone now where did it go Okay, so it's not in here, not in there, not in there, not in there, not in there, not in there. You'll see we made our apple juice. I have a little item sorter right here, a little apple juice, some fill blocks, and then an item sorter right there. But then where does that item go? Well, it's supposed to go over here, right here into this dispenser. Now, what the purpose of this is just to refeed the actual auto crafter because it's a reusable device the uh, purpose food press is a reusable device so then i just used a little elevator and then i ended up to refeed so if i cut on this little lever over here which is on a it's a, on a little hopper clock and then it's hooked up to the thing and you see how they go through right and they get dispensed into a little hopper right there and then boom and then it waits and then there we go we're making apple juice now until it's fully empty and then that now i don't know how to auto fill the apples and the glasses in there because then it auto fills the last slot so either i need to shorten this little elevator or just preload like a ton of food presses but these food presses are not cheap at all i mean two pistons and a hopper i'm good if i have to kind of do some manual labor here and there then it is what it is or if i've got like a stack of apples or whatever then that's great but regardless i'm i'm not i am not gonna yeah no I, that's so much materials i'm good this thing will run and run i mean look at how much we've already made so far We've made 38 apple juices, so yes. Item sorter into a dropper that's a water elevator that just refills the auto crafter with that. Is it jank? Yes, it is. It's very jank, but it's my jank, okay? <laughs> it is It is my jank, all right? Now, let's head back to the surface because, well, we got something else to do. So I guess the next part really for me to do is to get started building. I want to build another thing today. I think you guys already know that I, I want to build a Waffle House, okay? I want to build a Waffle House, and I'm 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 thinking about building it, like, just right over there. You see that little tiny plot over there? I, I got to build the Waffle House as well as the Motel 6 over here, and that's the plan, okay? So I grab some materials, all right? Uh, I got to, I got to, like, gosh, I need to, I'm thinking about starting the entrance right here. How about that? Entrance right there, and I already know that I'm gonna have to terraform a bunch of this stuff over here, but we're, we're just laying out the plot line for a little bit, okay? We're just laying out the plot line. And that should just about do it. Uh, editing magic is just wonderful. It really is wonderful. Um, okay, there's that. Extend this counter out one more. Cool, sweet, guys, okay. So we got like the little the little bar right here. We got the little little bar right there, you know, the, to where all they're doing all the cooking. We got our th entrance right over here. We've got, you know, it's going to be a, a little bit taller, but yeah, I think it looks good. I, now, I think it's just, um, I think I want to lay out one more outline, and that outline is going to be for the road in that Motel 6, so sorry, it's going to be two outlines, Ooh, but I, I, I wish I had replay mod for y'all because I need replay mod. I absolutely need it, and it is, it is, it's killing me to not have it to do these replays for you, but let's lay out this outline for this Motel 6, and then this little bit of a road and then we'll actually build the Waffle House. Finally, 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 finally 
got this little this motel six and we got a humongous we were doing some water bucket clutch and i don't have any of that interaction recorded i gotta keep my recording going at all times to be honest with you i'm just gonna start hitting record and because we had uh i i'm missing out on so many moments i really am and it's killing me it really is killing me but regardless here is the motel six so obviously you have your entrance right and you see here and then be like hi hi man i want i want a room yeah, you can get a room. Yeah. <laughs> I, don't <know. laughs> I don't know what I'm saying, bro. But there's like a little waiting area right here. And then after that, we got, you know, there's going to be a set of rooms. As you can see, this is going to be like the length of the room. And they're pretty decent. You know what I mean? They're they're pretty decent. Uh, You know, this is going to be another room. And then I'm thinking about stacking it on top as well to have like a little stairway. I mean, if you've ever seen a Motel 6, it, uh, then you know what I mean. But if you don't, then it is what it is. But yeah, we're gonna. We got your bed with your two little nightstands. We got your little AC thing, and then we got your TV stand right here. And then what's next is your bathroom right back here. So, what we're going to do is oh, we gotta wave to the people's the bathroom. You got your toilet. You got your sink right here. You got your shower or tub or whatever it is right there. And yeah, that's gonna be a room. And then we're gonna do another room back here right here and then we're gonna do like probably like five and maybe ten rooms or something like that and then we're gonna be good and it's gonna stretch out all the way to right here ish like i was thinking about like right here or maybe stretch it out over to here and it's gonna be like two three levels so we're gonna have a decent motel six honestly i might push it back a little bit so that way i can have some form of parking out front but that is going to be the first thing. It, uh, well, first first motel, hotel, Holiday Inn. Uh, please, if you get that reference, please, for the love of everything, please tell me you do. And then we got our main attraction, which is the Waffle House for right now until we get to building over there. Another thing that I was thinking about was doing some restaurants alongside of the road. You know what I mean? Like, we're going to probably build this road out maybe about, like, right about that wide-ish probably push it over that way and then we're gonna have like a little town square with some restaurants in it like uh maybe one over here then we're gonna probably have one over there and i'll get all that laid out eventually but main focus is waffle house okay so let's go ahead by the power of editing magic pillar be gone waffle house be right here and boom look at that look at that look at that it's a freaking Waffle House, man. It is a sick looking Waffle House, dude. I'm very proud about it. I have like these stairs to replicate, you know, it, it's got the brick base and the glass out front. Then if you just Google what a Waffle House looks like, this is somewhat similar. I want to say it's somewhat similar. It's literally a box, okay? It's literally a box. These stairs are different colors just to show like kind of how weathered it was from the sun beating on it and stuff like that. Uh, Yeah, you get the little Waffle House letters. We're going to have a grand open opening soon i mean it's really nothing i just want to say that you know the waffle house is open you can come in and buy stuff if you actually want to i'm not like i just i built this as a joke and i wanted to sell some stuff so yeah we got apple juice orange juice coffee got sunny side up eggs scrambled eggs toast butter toast and then i'm gonna have some other stuff like uh, the big breakfast and some sausage and stuff like that so also um over here employee of the month we had an employee of the month uh yeah it's 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 me i'm employee of the month hand what is that okay well looks like we need to put in a maintenance request uh either anyways um yeah this is a, there's you got cow to milk you got chickens that are that are producing the eggs for the scrambled eggs and stuff like that got a whole bunch of smokers here to smoke a bunch of things salt and everything in case food supplies get low and yeah we got little tables here you got these little lamps you got those little lamps up here you got holes in the roof that still need to be repaired i i thought that that was actually like a little little cool little thing like it, it's a waffle house it's not gonna be your top tier like you know what i mean it's a it's a waffle house this is a place that you come to at 2 a.m when you need some food you know what i'm saying uh yeah and pretty much and I, the doors don't always work all the time up here we just have the roof i need to put a couple of ac units up here um but I just, I wanted to get this built. I wanted to show you guys that I built the Waffle House 
in 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 Minecraft, okay? <laughs> I know it's been done before, but whatever. I really think this is one of my most extravagant builds I've ever done. But I love it. It's awesome. Also, uh, I had an employee. I had another employee. It was a waitress by the name of Llama Del Rey. Here's a screenshot. The proof. And I, I don't know where she went at all. I don't know where the llama went. I don't know. Uh, I'm going to put a wanted poster out um, or wanted or lost and found poster. Uh, I need I need Llama Del Rey back, please. If anyone has stolen her, I, I really need my waitress back because we have a grand opening happening and I can't I can't handle this myself. I think on the next episode, I showed you guys the um the motel six on the next episode i think we're going to be building that and also i hear that replay mod is in its patreon um stage and it's actually working so your your, your mans might actually get that so that way i can actually show some good decent replay footage for building stuff you know what i mean all right i think that's enough for this episode i think we're 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 kind of running out of time here i don't want to take up any more of your time uh e expect expect this next episode to have a grand re grand opening we're gonna build this next episode also we're, we i want to experience a tricky trials trick twisty trials tri ch um tr is that what it's called a tricky trials thing i want to experience that as well i also have another couple of farms cooking yeah it, it's 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 gonna be a jam-packed episode next episode okay so anyways i i'm going to say goodbye and you are going to click that like and subscribe button right you're going to click that like and subscribe button, right? Okay. All right. I will catch you guys in the next one. Goodbye.